to me, Elstrom Master Lee. And Lulu. Now, as you can probably tell, I'm more of a geek than a punk rocker, but man, some of these old school bands from back in the day, like, I feel like they're making a comeback these days. Mm hmm. Like Blink 182, yeah. got a new album coming out. And then, boom, Sum 41 has just dropped a new track from their new upcoming album. Mm. I'm like, I didn't even realize they were still together this whole time. I don't even know Sum 41. You're kidding me. I don't think so. Baby, they were great back in the day. Okay, that tells me Sum 41 Marathon is coming up. There was that whole era from like Green Day to Offspring to Blink-182 and then Sum 41. But yeah, the lead singer has a very distinct look. Yeah. He looked like a hooligan, the kind of guy who would just be like yelling a lot and get in trouble in school. Seems to be a great recipe for uh, starting up a punk rock band. <laughs> you listen to some of their songs and I guarantee you, you would know them. Yes. Yes. <laughs> That was some 41. This would be fun to, yeah. It's not like I'm going to be the perfect tour guide for this throwback because, uh, like I said, I'm more of a geek, but <laughs> I feel like some 41 had transcended just that genre, become so mainstream and so big. Mm. Apparently, this will be their last album. They are finally retiring. Finally. <laughs> <laughs> I know. There will be. All right, lead singer, he's 43. He's still young. Wait a minute. His spouse is Avril Lavigne. Huh? He got divorced. Oh, in 2010. That's right. She was married to Derek at one point. I remember this now. Really? Yeah. Oh, sh man, it's, it's all coming back. It's all it's flooding back with memories. <laughs> all right, let's do this, yo. By the way, if you want to hear some wicked wild stories, you got to check out my channel. And if you want some hotness, check out my fantasy show. Something awesome there. That's not them, is it? They're still out there skiing. And I don't want to believe that maybe this is the end. I know you're kind of a tease, but is this really pretend? Something tells me I'm wrong, but you I never can tell. The way you drag me along, the way I put you through hell. Oh no. Ah! You ever do that? I, I mean, you're a girl, I guess. You, no, you were Tom, but you would have totally did that. <laughs> Burn my fart? Yeah. Oh my God. I feel like everyone in high school at some point, like, all right, let's light your fart to see if you could actually do it. No. Okay, maybe it's a guy thing. <laughs> But yeah, it oh does burn, God. and if you're not careful, it can burst. Shoot! Is it? Oh yeah, baby, it's gas. Oh baby, you shouldn't you do it lying? because you're gas. <laughs> Oppenheimer, people. That's what we call her in the house. Uh, Oppenheimer. If you know what I mean? TMI. Dropping bombs. What the hell? By the way, this song is great. It feels like it honestly sounds like. Old school Sum 41. Mm -hmm. So I don't know if like their sound has changed or if this is a throwback, but this feels like I'm back in like 1990s yeah. again.
<laughs> the one dude. Oh, yeah. so sudden. I want to see the make out behind the bleachers. <laughs> I never got to Is it that normally life. Behind the Oh, you try, right, baby. You... <laughs> it's an American thing. I, mean, I grew up overseas, but I heard about it. It's just like, yeah, you know, you go behind the bleachers of the football field and uh, or in the <laughs> around. <laughs> that was fun. Oh, yeah. Great. I mean, it's a really great song. It, it feels like um, almost like a. Like, like, like coming back full circle for them. Mm. It just if I didn't know this was a new song, I honestly would think like this came out from like their first album. Mm. But it is like the song though is what I mean the lyrics are like the message that they're saying. Is like, yeah, I feel like everything is about that. About yeah. I feel like it's very deliberate choice, right? Like coming to an end, mm -hmm. the last hoorah. Looking back. But, oh, my God, they look so young. They can still play, huh? They look like they rock freaking hard. Although, I would say at this point, they don't look like teenagers anymore. Derek, for the longest time, looked like a perpetual teenager. Mm -hmm. He looked like he never aged. Now, he looks like he looks like Billy Idol in his later years. <laughs> Doesn't he? A little bit. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Throwback, y'all. Throwback. It is definitely.